What's up, everyone? Happy rainy Tuesday. Coming to you live from the truck today because uh, we got a meeting in Manhattan first thing this morning. So we'll do another afternoon ride. Yesterday we did the uh, we did 11 miles in the afternoon right before my live podcast with Sammy and Anthony. But um, we're riding in the truck on the way to Manhattan. Roads are flooded. Traffic's horrible. Great way to start the day. Uh, so, message of the day. Um, I like to listen to Joel Osteen in the morning. Kind of sets my day up. And he was talking about honor. You honor the people around you. That we all have uh, honor to give. And we need to give it. So, to explain that, basically, do we go out of our way to build people up in our lives? Do we go out of our way to tell people they're doing a good job? Do we go out of our way to make people feel good? Um, if you think about how good it feels for someone to reach out and say, hey, good job, hey, you know, nice work. Um, it really means a lot. And not only to you, but to them to share that honor with you, for them to honor you. So we need to go out of our way every day and look for ways to honor the people in our lives. We need to build up the people in our lives. So if someone around you is doing good, reach out and tell them they're doing a good job. Um, if someone, uh, I believe in tipping big, if uh, a waiter or waitresses or someone in your life really takes care of you, over tip them, tell them they did a good job. That's a tough, that's a tough job right there. Uh, on your feet all day and dealing with all the people and running back and forth with the food, uh, you know, honor them. Um, reach out to your friends around, <clears throat> around you and, uh, you know, tell them that you're proud of them. Tell them that, uh, you're happy for them, that whether it be a job promotion, whether just doing their job good or, um, whatever should happen. You reach out to your kids and tell them that they're doing a good job. You reach out to the people around you in your world and build them up. Uh, people are so quick to talk behind people's back, bad about people. How about talk good about people behind their back? How about when, uh, you're with a group of people and someone starts talking bad about someone. How about you uh, counteract that and speak good about them? Um, there's way too much negativity in the world. Um, we all need to go out of our way to build people up. We all need to go out of our way to uh, make the world a better place. I talk about that a lot. So, all right. So there's your message of the day. Go out of your way today to uh, build people up. Go out of your way today to tell someone they're doing a good job. Uh, pat on the back goes a long way. Um, so just think about that. Think about how you can do that. Think about who out there is, uh, standing out in the crowd and who out there could, could use a pat on the back. Cause, uh, sometimes we're in the struggle, we're in the grind. And, uh, sometimes just a little, someone reaching out saying, Hey, great job. I appreciate what you're doing. Uh, really means a lot and it's really free. So use your blessings to bless other people around you. It'll feel good. All right. So there's your message of the day. Uh, this traffic is horrible. All right, so let's jump on prayers. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to support everyone around us in our lives. Help us to unite and help us to uh, spread your love. Um, help us not to break people down, but to build them up and help us to uh, be grateful for all the people in our lives and help us to recognize all the blessings that we have. Uh, amen. Hi, everyone. So it's a rainy, nasty Tuesday. The roads are flooded. If you're not on your commute yet, get out there. It's going to take forever. Uh, I'm in the car here forever, and I'm still not even close to where I need to be. Roads flooded and closed and whatnot. So nasty morning, but this too shall pass. So we're heading into Manhattan today. We got a new job starting. We got a job meeting on another job and uh, trying to get some stuff done. Back from a long weekend, back to reality. And uh hope you saw our podcast last night with me and Sammy Smith and Anthony Hudson. Go back and look at my wall. We got to get some fire live. We just talked about life and uh, whatnot, how to live your life better. 
Go back and check that out. Comment on that. Let me know what you think of these uh, Monday night podcasts. Appreciate the support on that. And uh, if anyone wants to hear anything on these messages, I appreciate the look. And a couple people have reached out and have been giving me uh, a word of the day every now and then to work into it. And uh, a theme of the day. Um, we're 148 days in of messages and rides. Um, it's uh, we're almost halfway there, which is kind of cool. But I'm running out of stuff to talk about. So uh, I need some help from you guys. I need some support from you guys. Let me know what you want to talk about. Let me know what, what you're struggling with in your life. Let me know uh, what we can uh, bring to the forefront because uh, I don't want to keep repeating myself. I know uh, a lot of the messages are great to hear again, but uh, I find myself repeating. I'm just looking looking to know what you guys are listening, want to hear about, and uh, I need your support. So 148 days of my 365-day journey of We Ride at Dawn. Um, so those of you that don't know the message, just some comments on here. We are... Uh, I made this challenge for myself, sort of like a giant 75 hard, to ride my bike at least 10 miles a day for 365 days in a row. And at the midway point, uh, whenever the schedule works out, I come to you live with a message. So we are 148 days of live messages, 138, 148 days of uh, at least 10 mile bike rides. And we're uh, going for 365 days. Just an accountability goal I set with myself. Um, you know what, what do you want to be known for? I want to know, be known for, uh, uh, I don't know, doing good things and trying to help you guys out with live messages every day. I know sometimes we just need a pep talk in the morning. I myself need a pep talk in the morning. I jump on and, uh, you know, I listen to all my podcasts around with Ryan Stuman every morning and Joel Osteen and all the Goon Squad guys and a lot of other Apex people, uh, who shuffle through the mix. I listen to podcasts a lot, uh, and get a lot of inspiration out of it. I know what it does for me, so I like to... Uh, call it make a cake. I take a little information from each podcast I listen to and some ideas and whatnot from each podcast I listen to. And I mix it all together and I make my own cake for you guys to, uh, to share, to share with you guys every morning, hopefully inspire you to, uh, have a good day and do better in your lives. We're all in this together. Um, fire starts fire. So, uh, hopefully I'm inspiring you and hopefully you inspire someone else. And through that process, the world becomes a better place. So, um, what single thing are you inspired by? I'm inspired by love. Um, the love that people have for each other. Um, when people get out of the nonsense, get out of the, the grind, and they actually truly love um, the people that support each other, um, the people that reach out to each other, uh, the people that really just, uh, you know, try to make the world a better place. And, and I gravitate to those people. Um, a lot of those people are in my apex world. Uh, genuine, genuine people out there just trying to make the world a better place and trying to do better. Uh, do I dance? Of course I dance. I'm going to two-step with the boots on in Texas in uh, another week or so. And what love do I have? I love everybody. I love everybody. Um, love is a big thing in the world. you got to reach out to people in the world and, and love them. Uh, God is love, and we got to share that love. Because, um, again, we're all in this together. And the world is a hard place. It's a rough place sometimes, and a little bit of love goes a long way. So, love you too, Dawn. Who else is in here? What do I hate? I don't hate anything. Um, I mean, I made dislike. I made dislike hate. How about that? Uh, dislike hate. Uh, hate's a strong word. Um, I, I, I'm disappointed, maybe, uh, by people that hate. Um, but I don't like to hate. I don't like to use the word hate. It's a strong word. Strong word. I like to. Uh, I like to love. And uh, I made this, made dislike people that do bad things. I made dislike negative mindsets. I made dislike uh, negativity in the world. But hate's a strong word. I'm just I like to counteract hate with love. So what else we got there? Relaxed. Yes, we're relaxed. Uh, don't let stuff steal your joy. Um, like I said, I'm fighting traffic on the way into Manhattan this morning. Uh, in the past, this would get me wound up and cranky. And instead, I get to talk to you guys and spread some love and get a conversation going. What tests you? Luke's on with the, uh, the heavy hitter messages this morning. What tests me? What tests me? Um, sometimes patience tests me, I would say. Um, it's... Uh, 
I have sometimes, you know, trouble being patient and letting things happen. Um, I want a lot of things to happen right away. I want a lot of people to do the right thing right away. And uh, I get tested sometimes by um, negative mindsets and, and negative people. Um, I try to, uh, like I said, not let anyone steal my joy. It's, uh, you know, joy is something you have in your heart. And when uh, you let other people come into your life and make you upset, and steal your joy it um you know it can throw you sideways for the day so you really got to have your wall up around negative people and around um bad stuff i mean i don't watch the news for that reason garbage in garbage out i try not to fill my head with anything that's not positive um let's see what do we got here so i'm just trying to drive and read your messages Luke. uh patience yeah patience is a test uh let trust the process is uh it's something that definitely uh, we all gotta we all gotta deal with. We all gotta understand that uh, there's a process in play, and we need to have the patience and let things play out. And when you have patience with people around us that may be upset and may uh, have things going on in their lives and may uh, be taking stuff out on us, and they may have an attitude with us, and they may be cranky towards of us because they got other situations going on behind the scenes. So everyone's fighting a battle in the background, and we need to have patience with everybody in our lives. Uh, what else we got here? Keep me entertained here, Luke. Let's see. You got me on my toes. Uh, what are we looking at? I'm trying to read this. Sorry, it's a little hard. Joyful moments. Joyful moments. Joyful moments are, again, whenever I see love, um, joyful moments are always my children. Um, see them smile. See them succeed. Oh, it's always a joyful moment around the kids, no matter what's going on with the kids. Uh, even when they're yelling and screaming and doing kid stuff, uh, it's still joyful. It's still joyful to hear them and hear them and how they think and how they operate and uh, how they learn, how they love. Uh, it's always joyful. Um, let's see what else we got here, Luke. What is your process? My process, process, my process. Um, uh, I guess what's my process? My process is to try and do good and help people. I find uh, I get a uh, I get joy out of helping people. I get joy out of inspiring people. Um, I get joy out of interactions with people and, and sharing some love and sharing ideas and sharing mindset. Um, my process is to uh, wake up every morning and try and make the world a better place. Uh, I say it a lot. I like to put my head on a pillow every night, knowing that I made the world a better place. If I could touch one person a day through my messages. That's 365 people a year that I get to touch and get to inspire and make their world better. And uh, that's my process. Let's see. What else we got here? Luke's on fire this morning. Uh, dance on your toes. Yes, you got to stay on your toes. God's time, not ours. Yes, yes. Uh, let's see. How am I helping myself? I help myself every day, honestly, with uh, these messages. So when I speak to you, um, I try to speak into existence, things that I'm struggling with in my life, things that I'm trying to make better in my life. And as I speak it to you, I'm actually speaking it to myself. Um, it's definitely uh, motivational for me to get up here and, and share some love with you guys and share some knowledge and interact with you guys in the morning. Uh, let's see. And that helps me uh, become a better place. Um, you guys hold me accountable. You guys make sure that I'm on the message every day. You guys make sure that I'm doing my ride every day. Um, it's uh, That's how I help myself. I surround myself with amazing people. And I continue to keep, keep trying to find amazing people and keep uh, keep them in my lives. Uh, let's see. Is that love to touch? Right here. Big things, beautiful world. Yes, the world is a beautiful place. Um, we have a choice every morning to wake up and be positive or wake up and be negative. I say this a lot. Um, it's all just um, what you will into it. Um, if you think about negative stuff, negative stuff is attracted to you. If you think about positive stuff, positive stuff is attracted to you. So if you wake up every morning and you look at the positive, you wake up every morning and, and look for a beautiful day. Um, it's a rainy, nasty day today, but you know what? We need the rainy days to appreciate the sunny days. So you have to appreciate a rainy day. It's kind of calming. It's kind of peaceful. Rather than letting the rain get you upset, Rather than let the traffic get you upset, let it slow you down. Let it uh, 
let you self enjoy the ride a little bit because uh, it's um, every day is a journey. Uh, we talked about it last night. I like to wake up every morning and say, thank God it's Monday. Thank God it's Tuesday. We need to enjoy every day. We need to appreciate every day. We need to have fun every day. Um, we can't just exist waiting for the good times. We have to enjoy the mediocre times, even the bad times. And we have to appreciate the bad times to realize that uh, with every bad time, there's a good time right behind it. And uh, this too shall pass. Uh, my buddy Mike Claudio posted that the other day. It's some words I love to hear. What else we got here, Luke? Um, are you excited? I'm always excited. Uh, I'm excited for the future. I'm excited to see what life's going to bring every day. New opportunities show up in my life. New people show up in my life. And it's exciting. It's exciting to wake up every morning. It's exciting to uh, chat with you down in uh, Australia. Um, it's uh, it's exciting. It's exciting. The world is exciting. Life is exciting. Um, sometimes we get depressed and things happen in our lives and knock us down and friends show up and light us up and uh, you got to keep your eyes open. You got to look at the positive. Positive attracts positive. Push out the negative and bring in the positive and uh, fun stuff, fun stuff. I get to chat with my Australian friend over here. The world is a crazy place. Technology is amazing. Um, it's just so cool to uh, really uh, connect with people across the world through technology and people with similar mindsets. Um, Next day, next moment. Yep, what's around the corner? Has, it's it's exciting. It's uh, it's like uh, Christmas morning. Every morning we get to open up the new day, the new present. To live in the present. Each day is a gift, and uh, we need to open that present up and uh, and enjoy it. Love it, brother. Love it. Love it. Appreciate the support. Keep me entertained as I drive into Manhattan. So. Yeah. Run free, run free. That's, that's it. We all got to free ourselves from uh, the, the shackles, the shackles of negativity, the shackles of negative mindset. We got to run free. Run free. Let it flow. And my friend Stacy always talks about we got to get in a flow state. We got to let things flow. Uh, we got to release, release the bad stuff and embrace the good stuff. There's so much, so much good stuff in life. And uh, we tend to neglect the good stuff and we tend to harp on the bad stuff and it's just really really all in our heads we really got to clear those negative mindsets out of our heads and we really need to just focus on the good so all right let me get back to driving i gotta try and get through this traffic jam here luke it was awesome talking with you i appreciate the uh the questions and the feedback um fun stuff Uh, i'm gonna jump on i'm gonna jump on driving here because i probably shouldn't be uh trying to read this as i'm sitting here in traffic but uh, flow like a calm river. I love it. Love it. We got to get in our flow states. We got to get in our play- happy places. And we got to let things happen in our lives and enjoy every moment of our lives and just share the good vibes. So, so message of the day. This one was a long one, but uh, this was fun. This was fun. Um, get to speak with my Australian friend. Um, so uh, mindset, guys, um, go out there and try and be good to someone today. Not just someone. Try and be good to multiple people today. Go out of your way. To tell someone they're doing a good job. Go out of your way to tell someone you love them. Go out of your way. Build someone up. Um, if each one of us on here built up someone else and they built someone else up and they built someone else up, think about what the world would be. Uh, in this world where hate makes headlines, goodness needs to speak up. We need to speak up and share the love. So, all right, everyone, I'm signing off. I got to get driving here. I got to get to Manhattan and get this day going. I appreciate all of you. I appreciate the... Uh, the comments, Luke, that's fun. And uh, I need some more messages today. So uh, post to my wall, DM me. Uh, what are you struggling with? What would you like to learn more about? What would you like to discuss? Um, I'm having fun interacting with all of you guys. And uh, I know a lot of us are very similar. The stuff we struggle with behind the scenes is all the same stuff. Um, and you know what? Together, we can move mountains. We're all in this together. So uh, let's do it together. Hi, everyone. I appreciate you. Remember, put your head on the pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Go reach out and help someone today and build them up. Uh, Appreciate you all. God bless. Have a great day. Stay dry.